profit markup, profit margin. Think profit markup and profit margin. All the business organization selling price. Think selling price decided based on cost value. Therefore, cost plus profit equal selling price. Cost plus profit equal selling price. Therefore, profit can be determined based on cost value or profit can be determined based on selling price. Think how to apply profit markup, profit margin. If it is markup, think markup and margin. Profit markup, profit margin. Think normally selling price equal cost plus profit. Profit can be decided. Profit can be decided based on cost value. It is called profit markup. Think example profit equal 40%. Profit equal 40%. If it has decided based on cost value, it is called profit markup. But if it has decided based on selling price, profit equal 40%. But if it has decided based on cost value, it is called profit markup. Therefore, if it is markup, cost value 100. The think selling price can be calculated. But if it is margin, profit decided based on selling price. Profit decided based on selling price, it is called profit margin. If it is margin, selling price 100. The thing cost value can be calculated. Cost value equal 60. Therefore, by using profit markup and profit margin, if it has given cost value, can be calculated profit and selling price. Think why we have to discuss profit markup, profit margin. If it has given cost value, profit can be calculated or selling price can be calculated. And if it has given selling price, profit can be calculated and cost value. Cost value mean cost of sales. Cost of sales, cost value can be calculated if it has given selling price. If it has given profit, cost of sales and selling price can be calculated. If you have a item, you can do it. By using profit mark or profit margin. Think example, cost of sales equal example, cost of sales. Cost of sales equal uh, think example 200,000. Cost value, cost of sales equal to 1000. They are selling price. Think profit markup equal profit markup equal 40%. Profit markup equal 40% given cost of sales, cost value equal to 1000. Then you can calculate profit and selling price. Cost value is given. Think example profit markup. Therefore, can we calculate profit? Think how to calculate profit. Therefore, profit equal. Profit equal, think cost value equal 100. Therefore, cost of sales, cost value is given to 1000. It is equal in this example. Think markup 100. Therefore, divide by 100 into 40 can be calculated profit. That is gross profit. Therefore, gross profit equal 8000. Think how to apply profit markup, profit margin. And think cost value equal to 1000. Selling price also can be calculated. If they are selling price, think cost value equal to 1000. It is equal in this example 100. Therefore, divide by 100 into think here will be equal 140. <coughs> profit markup, profit decided based on cost value. Therefore, think cost value 100. Profit equal 40. Selling price equal 140. It has given cost value. Therefore, selling price can be calculated. Cost value divided by 100 into 140. Selling price can be calculated. The thing here will be equal to 208,000. Think it has given cost of sales, how to calculate profit and selling price. And think margin also. If it has given profit margin, if it has given profit margin, think this example. Right. Think cost value equal example cost of sales. Cost of sales it is equal cost value. Uh, think this example cost value equal. Now I will discuss margin. 
cost per is given 204,000 cost of C is equal to 204,000 profit markup margin is given 40% then cost per is then can be calculated profit and selling price cost per is equal cost of sales then how to calculate gross profit gross profit profit mean gross profit here can be calculated by using markup and margin the thing if it is margin think profit equal 40 percent then now the cost value equal 60 then when calculate gross profit 240,000 cost cost of sales cost value it should be divided by 60 that value divided by 60 into 40 think how to calculate gross profit if it has given profit margin cost of c is equal to 40 that value equal 60 divided by 60 into 40 equal gross profit now this one divided by 4 equal this one divided by 60 into 40 then 240 divided by 60 into 40 then think gross profit equal 160,000 as a selling price also can be calculated think selling price equal cost value 240 Think margin 40%, therefore 240,000 divided by 60, think cost value equal 60 into 100. Think by using profit markup, profit margin, if it has given cost value, profit and selling price can be calculated. If it has given selling price, profit and cost of sales can be calculated. Think given cost of sales, how to apply profit markup, profit margin. By using profit markup, profit margin, Think how to calculate cost of sales as a gross profit. Then this one divided by 60, 240 divided by 60 into 100 equal selling price. Then selling price equal rupees 400,000. Given cost of sales, think how to apply profit mark or profit margin. By using profit mark or profit margin, think how to calculate cost of sales as well as selling price. Now I will discuss, now I will discuss if it is given selling price. How to calculate cost value as a gross profit by using profit markup, profit margin. Right. Think first one profit markup. First one profit markup. Think selling price equal 560,000. Selling price. Given selling price now. Selling price equal 560,000. Think how to apply profit markup. By using profit marker, gross profit and cost of sales. Cost value mean cost of sales can be calculated. Think profit markup equal 40%. If it is markup, cost value 100. Selling price equal 140. Given selling price, they ask <coughs> cost of sales and gross profit. Think first one gross profit how calculates. Gross profit how calculates. This value divided by now think selling price equal 140. Therefore, 560,000 divided by 140 into 40 equal gross profit. But if they ask cost of sales, <coughs> if they ask cost of sales, if they ask cost of sales, think selling price equal 140, markup is given 40%. Therefore, this value divided by 140 into 100 equal cost of sales. Given selling price, profit markup is given 40%. Therefore, selling price equal 140 into 100 equal cost of sales. Selling price is given, it is equal in this example 140. Therefore, this value divided by 140 into 40 can be calculated gross profit. This value divided by 140 into 100 can be calculated cost of sales. Think how to apply profit markup. Given selling price, cost value, it is called cost of sales and gross profit can be calculated. There are 560,000 divided by 140 into 40. Everything here, gross profit equal 160,000. As is 560,000 divided by 140 into 100 can be calculated. Cost value, it is called cost of sales. Think how to apply profit mark or profit margin. Profit markup mean profit decided based on cost value. Profit margin mean profit decided based on selling price. If it is markup, very important this marks cost value 100. If it is margin, 
selling price 100. If it is margin. Now think if it has given selling price. Selling price is given. How to apply profit margin? Then this example also. You have to know how to get the gross profit as the selling price. Gross profit and cost of sales. Given selling price, think about 5,000. Selling price 5,000. But now think how to apply profit margin. They ask gross profit and cost of sales. Can we calculate gross profit as well as cost of sales? It has given selling price. First one thing, how to get quick gross profit? How to get quick gross profit? Selling price is given. It is equal in this example. Selling price is given 5,000. It is equal in this example 100. Therefore, this value divided by 100 into 40 equal gross profit. And this value divided by 100 into 60 equal cost of sales. Therefore, think selling price equal 5,000. Divided by 100 into 40 can be calculated gross profit. The value equal 200,000. 200,000. And cost of sales also can be calculated given selling price. Therefore, cost of sales. Cost of sales. Selling price equal 5,000. But given margin, therefore it is equal selling price 100. But think gross profit equal, so cost of sales equal 60. This value divided by 100 into 60 can be calculated cost of sales. They think cost of sales equal 300,000. Think how to apply profit market profit margin. Think general equation or the business organization normally selling price determine cost plus profit. Markup and margin. It is depend on how to decide profit. It is depend on how to decide profit. If profit decided based on cost value, it is called markup. If profit decided based on selling price, it is called margin. Therefore, by using profit markup and profit margin, can be calculated. If it has given cost value, gross profit and selling price can be calculated. If it has given selling price, gross profit and cost of sales can be calculated. And if it is given profit, selling price as well as cost of sales can be calculated. Think by using profit markup and profit margin. First one you have to know how to decide profit. Markup and margin. Markup means profit decided based on cost value. Margin means profit decided based on selling price. Very important, if it is markup, cost value 100. If it is margin, selling price 100. By using those information, Right. Profit marker, profit margin.